every one way I've walked over to the point of uh, the Visayas Island here by uh, near Brock Tightbeho. Just beautiful. Big old, uh, we call them lava rocks. These are more black than where we were over where we beached the boat. But uh, yeah, that goes around the coast here and then probably gets more calm. Very windy, about 25. It's a 35 mile an hour breeze coming off the ocean here. It's coming out of uh, that way. So I, th I think that's the north across the uh, bay here. So it's uh, just beautiful. I've left the group a few minutes to uh, wanted to see what was around here, but you see the surf spray up, the water spraying up. It's kind of foggy over through there. It's really cool to see. This is a very little more rocky up here, mainly rocks where we beach. There's a about 50% sand, so it's a little nicer, although this is cool too. So I was just checking out this big rock over here, wanted to take you over and look at that, and then we're double back, but comes a fishing boat uh, around the point there. Let's see if I can see that. Right there we go, trying to battle the rough surf. So we'll have to do that on the way back because we came with the wind, so much easier going back. So just all kinds of things on the shore here, coconuts and some trash up there in the, where the high tide mark is. And, uh, but yeah, this is cool how uh, just a rock out of nowhere, it looks like it's 15, 20 feet high from here. I'll know more when I get up next to it because I'm six foot. But we ended up coming over here. It's three o'clock in the afternoon. They're back there talking and sitting and cooking some fish. This almost looks like a petrified tree, but I know they don't have trees this well, at least where I'm at. I haven't seen any trees that big, but it looks like a big tree. There comes the boat. So much calmer here. We're more out of the wind now that we've come up there, but you can just see the mist coming off there so where it looks foggy that's just the waves crashing and water spray coming up looks like a little inlet around the corner but uh we'll get back with the group here i just uh didn't think the island would be quite as interesting as it is so different uh coral rocks there of various kinds so you never know what you might find washed up on the shore so that's just really neat that I'll get over closer to it just tallest one on the point here that I can see so yeah I'd say that's uh 15 feet high and look at the palm I'll call it palms just beautiful uh, the short stuff's bamboo so just wonderful I've been really fortunate blessed to meet so many people and I uh, get to see things like this. This is uh, what a lot of people dream of their whole life is to come to a tropical island and you meet the friendly people and they certainly are friendly and get to explore and see such beautiful things. Back in Ohio it's probably could be anywhere from 60 degrees to 30 degrees of uh, rain, snow, cloudy. Might have a few warm days in November but here it's going to be like this in December, uh, January. Every month I've been here since last January has been like this. So uh, just sunny, 80, 85 degrees every day, every night, 75 maybe, low mid to upper 70s every night. Just endless. I call it endless summer coming from Ohio. So. That's where I've spent my uh, 60 years. I've just been over here almost a year. Well, in fact, uh, today's the 12th, the 14th is 11 months. So, almost a year. So, I'm just trying to share my journey and experiences. And whenever I meet people or see something interesting, it says it's private property there, so somebody owns it. So, we won't go up there. Hopefully, I'm not local here so I'm assuming people don't know the shoreline but maybe they do but I don't see any houses so 
we're cut back around the point and just wanted to share this uh, different parts and the people I'm with and so I've made a few videos the winds really picks up as soon as you come around the corner here so but that's it from the Terry's Philippine journey today off the coast of the Sias Island Brock Tuck near Brock Tuck BOE Low Elo over there's Negris below the uh, clouds it's uh, some bigger mountains I'll call it tall hill big mountains that's Negris Island over there so thanks for watching everyone take care and stay safe that's it from the Philippines.